Hey yo folks, Quilly Teen here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Crusader Kings 2! We got problems, we got problems. We just, we just died, we've got, we've got a new Duke, Big Franks over here. Uh, we're gonna hopefully reunite our duchy over here under our command so we have a little bit more control. We're not yet in control of France, and France ain't going so well! Australia keeps growing in leaps and bounds here, which... It was a little less than ideal, if I gotta be honest. We do have a ton of cash. Um, I think some of it was saved from Mercs. I think we'll go and develop a little bit in uh, Orleans over here. Uh, France is in a few wars that are not going that well, unfortunately. So things are going to keep looking a little rough and tumble. Uh, we do have some new tech available here. We've got an ahead of time penalty, but I'm going to go ahead and invest in the heavy infantry because we've actually got a fair amount of that. So we're going to make our heavy infantry a little bit better, and if we keep focusing on building more and more of it, that would be okay. I mean, just, you know, bigger levy size is pretty good, but here, you can see here the barracks, just a flat number of more stuff, um, and in particular heavy infantry. So I think we're going to go ahead and start some barracks over here in, uh, in Orleans, in Orleans. Now we might do a little bit more developing of some of these other towns. Uh, and a few of these other places as well. But the technology hasn't spread the same way. So, I don't know. I mean, we could still get some bigger levy sizes. That might not be a terrible idea, actually. Let's go and spend another batch on uh, some level 1 barracks or whatever over here. Legion's Council is discontent. My council is discontent. But there could be worse things. Um, some oh, prosperity has dropped because of my incompetent steward. My, my steward's not incompetent. He's freaking 21. What the hell, man? Um, do we want to shuffle around some things? Maybe. Absolute rule law. It sounds pretty good to me for my, um, my family to have. Let's go ahead and go back to raising taxes. Oh, yeah. I'm going to go for troops over here rather than tech. Um... Maybe we can keep going cultural tech, that's going to be okay. You can study technology way over here. Um, and the Chancellor can basically just keep chilling and doing his thing here. As we try... Aha! Duke Last Revenant! So terribly sorry, Last Revenant. Uh, you have been smothered by a pillow. Um, you know, that damn shame. Oh, it's really sad that something like that happened. I, I, can't, I can't imagine um, how it happened. Oh, it's terrible. But uh, let's go ahead and make our, you know, our crown focus some more. So now we do have access to two duchies worth of stuff. Now, hopefully, we can get our vassals to actually like us. Um, because a few of them are not that happy. In particular, it would be nice if the uh, the bishops here liked us a fair bit. Maurice would like a seat on the council. He's actually very good at learning. Very good at learning. Now, we could upset this guy, but he's I don't know if he's that critical. Um, we might want to appoint this guy, because he's very pissed. I mean, he'll still maybe be a malcontent, but I think he'll bounce back very easily. Uh, oh, 71! You know what? He's going to die soon anyway. Let's not worry about that guy. That's going to be okay. So do I want to jump in and, you know, help out with any of these wars over here? For the Kingdom of France. I mean, my he still has access to some of my levies, and of course some of my tax dollars, so I think we're not going to stress too much about it. We're going to keep trying to expand our own dynasty. No one accepted my invitation to go carousing. Uh oh. No carousing for me. Finish education in the ways of war. Excel in his studies. That Edvin, you are quite the martial minded person. And a few weak claims in a couple places. That's interesting. Let's get you married off to someone here. Um, claims may or may not matter that much. Uh, anything genetic? Maybe we can take advantage of here. Attractive, not bad. Bright is ba oh, you're 40 and gay. It's a little tougher to deal with. 45, no. 26 and gay and chase. That's right. Your 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 fertility be so damn low. Doesn't mean you can't have kids. Just the odds are so much lower. Strong and gay. It's probably why these people aren't married. Uh, okay, we got a 25-year-old genius. She's Maya Fizzite. I don't know what that is, but I think we're going to go for it. Get some genius in our blood. See what we can do about that. We might have some more marriages to do. So these are raiders. I mean, we want to stop them anyway. Hey, a daughter was born! 
the Anonymous Clan as well. Okay, got my Extra Life Donators list over here. And the next person's name on the list is... Moldakai. Moldakai. Welcome to the family! Glad to have you here. So, friend... Oh my god, more wars are kicking out. Liberation Revolt. At least that's not going so well for them. Hmm, the peasants, long time the road. Oh, yeah, yeah, we'll go ahead. We'll spend the money, get the piety. Prosperity in Geneva, sure, that's fine. I can raise 3k troops on my own. I do have money for mercs to help out with some of this, but... What is this? My liege. Loyal servants such as I deserve some recognition and rewards from time to time. It's widely known that you hold huge, tr huge tracts of land and many titles. This is generous. Oh, oh, you are, you have the desire to get a title. Um, I could get a favor. I could just say yes. Uh, I'd say no. I would be happy to grant you this reward, but... So, diplomatically informed that no, I'm keeping all my stuff. Screw off. Screw off. No title for you. Oh my god, France is going to fall apart. But that's okay. I mean, we're not France. Although, the county of France might be a little bit of a thing. I don't know if any of these are, like, usurper-type things. No, they're just holy wars for, like, all kinds of territory. Okay, we're going to go and we're going to participate in some of this. I'm going to I'm gonna come down here. Smack these guys around. We can help out a little. Oh, there's the, uh, the king's army. Could officially join in more of these wars. Get more credit for it. But I'm just going to help a little. And then stand down, probably. I mean, I don't think it matters that much if I'm in the wars or not. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah. Levies raised too long. I know. It's terrible. Alright, go. Nope, not, not that province. This province. Thank you. So that should go well. Big numbers, improved relations. Okay. Lots of discontentment. Dark days. My wife has been beset by strange rashes and episodes of delirium. Oh, camp fever. Call my court physician at once. Yeah, she's had a lot of things wrong with her for a while here. And, oh yeah, that's... F huh, that's interesting. When she dies, the duchy titles will still go to my kingsman, which is good. And we can't change laws forever because we've just... Or can we? We can change these. Can't change these? Okay, so for this we have to reign for 10 years. This one we don't, although it starts a new cooldown timer. On the other hand, centralization is quite good for me. Oh, we can go to late administration here, because we've got legalism equal to 3. Realize the importance of inheritance together to facilitate... Or keeping the inheritance together to facilitate dynasty's long-term increase and yada yada yada. Additional succession laws. Yeah, okay. The vassals who refuse liege interference in wars are seen as traitors. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and pass that. Because it's good for me. And then, yeah, we'll pass inheritance changes later on. We've got some epidemics that are kicking around. Which, I mean, I suppose I could have told you that with the whole camp fever thing with my wife. If you're running back over here, I could merge up with you, actually. Probably be a big enough army to take on some more significant threats. Um, hmm. Well, let's finish one level of D siege. Ruler and married. My wife did die. So my domain went down. I'm going to go ahead and marry, I think, for high stewardship then. Someone who's not sick. It's not about genes or anything like that. It's just we're going to marry for some stats here. Yeah. Wizgardia. We'll lose some prestige from this quite a bit, actually, but we'll deal with it. Done and done. Um, we can get some of the prestige back, but I'll keep going for gold, especially at this point. We can really invest it in a lot of buildings. Okay, we've desieged that, which is nice. Um, I might go and desiege more of it over here. I don't know. These guys are coming back here. Yeah, you're going back to Dax? I'll just jump on you when you arrive. There you go. I mean, you'll be able to run again, but that's going to be okay. We're actually going to get a bonus to attack? 
Where's that bonus to his defense and heals? I don't know. Which are relative unit types. Guess I could have looked at the battle screen. There we go. Um, where'd the big army go? Right down there. Well, let me just desiege this then. I'll still be a little bit useful for the war. Some of the things have pieced out here. Um, ooh, smugglers realm. Good. Uh, usurp the title. Yeah, so some stuff was lost. I think overall we're okay. Uh, barracks were built in Blois. Orleans, are you still building? Yeah, you're still building. Who's this? It's Garnet! Fi oh, intricate web weaver. And ambitious. 16 years old. We would like someone with claims, probably. Sure. This person. I don't, I'm not checking to see if they're inheritable or whatever, and maybe I should be specifically shopping for, you know, someone in another realm. But that's okay. Let's take a quick look at our dynasty tree. How many people we got? 54 living members. 100 total members we have reached. Having a hard time going up in living members, but we'll get there. Uh, my vassal is expected to have fashion choice advisors. She's a more qualified than the majority of your council. She would make an excellent spy master. It would be controversial, however. Um... She would like me a lot. But, I would be replacing someone of my dynasty, so I'm going to say no. Oh, Waldesian religion. I don't think we're going to go and become a, a heretic whatever yet. Secretly become Waldesian. Um, he's crazy. Arrest him. So, we've lost our court chaplain. Well, you know what, then? We'll go ahead and put Maurice in here. Yeah, that makes him very, very happy. Very, very happy. You probably won't die or live for very long, but, you know, that'll work out for now. So, we never did join a faction with this character. It seems like the sort of thing we want to do. Unless we, like, assassinate our way up like crazy. Become Shia again? I think I talked about wanting to become Benedictine Order on this go, so that's what I'm going to do. Ooh, it costs money. Alright, I'll do it. It's fine. Worked out last time. We got a lot of really good uh, relationship with our, our temple vassals and things. We got a lot of really great events. Seduction in the wild. Form count, blah, blah, blah. Tried to recruit her in a scheme to seduce my wife, that randy goat. Count Richard and I become a seducer. And he's seduction focused. We've become bitter rivals. We could plot to kill him. Why is there Christmas music playing? I mean, it is December. I guess that would be it. <laughs> Alright, let's just sit here and de siege some of this stuff. Um, this is the actual revolution that's causing some problems, and we don't want the liberation to happen. We can shut the gates to prevent disease. We're not gonna! We're not going to. We're gonna stand with our people. Oh my god, they found the affair. We can imprison my wife. But why would I want to? It's fine. Just dismiss for now. Is there a way to skip songs in this one? There was like a music player in some of the other Paradox games. But I don't know about this one. I don't know, the Christmas music is... Is it good? What do we think? So there's the army there. I might be able to merge up with them and convince them to go. Let's get the siege done. We'll move up um, a little closer to the front and see what we can do. Our barracks are done in Orléans. We still got lots of money. Excellent. We're just going to keep building as much as we can. We'll go for the keep here for the increased levy, levy size percentage. And all of a sudden more sounds. As I'm beating a rabbit dog in the yard, the little cur Jordan runs up and starts hitting me with a stick. I'll show the Hungarian child. Okay. Maybe become haughty. How adorable. Oh, we'll do this. We'll gain some prestige. Oh, we've become better rivals. Oh, well. Okay, so the siege is done. So, yeah, let's get a little closer. We can maybe bop this little group as well. Help out my king. What's my... Oh, I can ask my leash for a title. Let's do it. I think he said no last time, but let's try it again. Here. We're going to um, officially... 
join in your wars. Oh, that's his high diplomacy. He was able to just shrug me off, probably? I don't know. There we go. Okay, now at least your army's flag is blue, which makes things a lot easier to see. We'll go engage there, and then we'll just follow this army. Or, I don't know where you're going. Are you desieging something? Where are you off to? Okay, victory, good. Uh, found a great philosopher. Help me enhance culture. Yes, we'll spend the money for a culture boost and maybe a prosperity boost. I guess we're at war with the people over here. Uh, oh! Oh, the king left the council meeting! Uh, faith cry for help. Call out others to mock him. I don't want to give him the drunkard trait or remove things. I'm going to get to the point where he owes me a favor. That sounds handy for the king to owe me a favor. Uh, Darmling and Romelia have a new son, not named Arno, but rather Mr. U10. Mr. U10, welcome to the family! Excellent. Where the hell are you going? I don't know, but we're gonna go ahead and just link to you. You got uh, plenty of people. Go and beat up those guys so we don't you don't give up anyone in a revolution. Try to do well, man. Hmm. You are perhaps not spending the appropriate effort in matters of theology. I'd like to encourage you to set aside worldly worries and focus on matters divine in nature. So I have a mission. Oh, to pick the theology focus. Instead of carousing. Sure. Let's do it. Oh, can't change the focus yet. But we will at some point. Uh, such a wonderful bouquet. The complex blend of flavors spreads over my tongue just as warmth threads my body. Oh! Monks know how to make wine. Uh, chance of a learning. I might become drunkard. Or I could just gain the chance, the, the trait temperate. There's not a very big chance they become drunkard, but it's pretty bad if it happens. So I'll go that way. Um, merchant caravan, sure, we'll let them in. I think you can get eunuch out of this one. I think sometimes it might go badly, but mostly just end up with eunuchs. Alright. Got a eunuch added to our group. So yeah, it's 10,000 strong. You can go and rush the sieges, apparently, and then you're going to go and stomp on those guys. There we go, and then we can take down our troops and save ourselves some money soon. Boom. Victory, victory. Who lacks childhood focus? It's Johan! What kind of traits you got going on, man? Uh, let's go for your diplomacy focus. Always super strong. I mean, intrigue's good too, but this is okay. So usurping of titles. I mean, we haven't done anything for ourselves in a while, and maybe we should. Battle's not going quite as well as I originally hoped, but there we go. Smash, smash, smash. We had a huge numbers advantage, so it should be okay. Oh, 100%! They must have captured someone, so that piece is going to happen in a second. And I'm going to go ahead and reduce my troops now. Boom, boom, boom. Excellent. So we'll get them back, because they're not going to be needed, so it's going to be okay. There was the peace. All right, so France holds together for a little bit longer. Although it's a little bit scary. What kind of things can I press? County of Thuringen. From Sweden, but... Yeah. Um. Wow, you have... Oh, it's all your tribal vassals. I'm going to say, you can't raise that many troops, but the tribal vassals, that's where the strength is coming in. Hmm. Can I do hospital buildings yet? No, no tech. All right. I'll have to work on that a little bit more. Speaking of tech, noble customs, it's just getting people to like us more. It's the construction we need. Ah, uh, we've got another daughter! Well, not our daughter directly, but it's another anonymous daughter who is going to be Mulipuja. There's no way that's how it's pronounced. I was just going through it phonetically to try to work it out, but I'm going to call you Millie. There you go. Millie! Uh, my chancellor's improving relations. That's good. Yeah, we've got a crazy epidemic. Camp fever kicking around here and being a problem potentially. Probably going to kill off lots of members of our dynasty as it goes. 
Meanwhile, we're not currently plotting any assassinations. So, what's the situation in Australia? Are we in, like, can we get in here in any way? Can we arrange a matrilinear marriage which is with someone from my dynasty? Oh, we can. Okay. And what about this kid? I guess I could just stay on that previous screen, huh? Arrange betrothal. Matrilineal. Um... I don't know the youngest, because you're not very old, right? Zero, yeah, you're newborn. Okay, you won't do it. Would you do it for someone else? No, no. Okay, fair enough. Um, how about this girl? She's already married. And this girl? Nope. And this girl? No. Uh, you're not... M you are married. So... Oh, that was the Duchy of Burgundy. Which is actually fine, because if we can get in there too, that's good. What about the kingdom? Yeah, see, my kinsmen over here. There are ways to get there. The question is... Can we assassinate our way there? Probably not, but maybe if I became a secret Muslim assassin again. Yeah, none of this is particularly good. Even the kid? Relatively hard to kill. Hmm. Hmm. Kingdom of Aquitaine. Oops. No. Okay. Well, we did get something in there. That's for in line for the title of Burgundy. Which is somewhere over here, right? Duchy of Burgundy. That's this Martin guy. 45%. 50% over here. And that's before we start any bribes. Oh, I have to um, send a gift. Invite the plot. That brings us up to 80%. It's as close as we can get, but might get something going. Collected a special tithe. Nice. Alright, well, we'll give that a try. I wonder if any of these people might be just on the cusp. Oh no! Gurgling pressure in the gut! Only warning before your force maker dash the privy. We have diarrhea. Uh, that is a big killer of people. Lance is fairly sure you've developed camp fever. She insists you follow. Your, her instructions. I'm not sure that did anything. Try to reconnect with the moon? Yeah, I don't think that's going to be terribly helpful. Particularly heated argument in the council. You stepped in as Duke Hildevold the Chaste was making fool himself. Decided to soothe the debaters and win the argument for him. Though this only infuriated him as one to win the argument by his own means. Throwing a tantrum like this has publicly shamed him. Well, we gained some prestige from doing that. I guess that's something. We now have fatigue. Oh, we might end die a lot sooner. Do you think I have bubonic plague? It's plenty of spicy food. Yeah, that, that's a good idea when I have diarrhea. I now have a headache. Oh, no. Camp fever. Yes, that's probably true. Anton has finished his... Oh, he's turned into a crappy character. I'm really sorry, Anton. And you have a fever as well. Maybe I should have closed all the doors. Anton, private discussion, Benedictine. Yeah, you got some good traits from that. You are humble. Sure, that's fine. Not particularly stunning stats throughout, but... Holy War has ended. King Archambeau has won. Well, that is at least good news. Oh my god, my whole family of dynasty is going to die off. Um, where are we plotting to kill this dude? Where are you? You're in Nevers over here. So we will actually send the Spy Master to Nevers to increase our plot power. 
my wife will call for the court physician. I think everyone's gonna die off. Oh, my wife has been skillfully um, treated. Okay, well that might be good news. I do officially have camp fever. Shut the gates. Well, it's too late for that. Prominent subject is positioned for justice. His daughter has supposedly been beaten by Marshal J21 Balls while he was their guest and the father's requesting compensation. Find... I like becoming just. But then I imprison him. So this would definitely give me arbitrary. This is only a chance of becoming arbitrary. We're going with this. I'm going to defend my dynasty here. Court physicians come to see you and offer several treatments for your illness. She explains there are several different types of treatments you can offer. <sighs> for camp fever. Typhus. How bad is this? How much am I gonna... Minus four health is a lot of minus health. Oh, I'm still carousing. Can I switch yet? Theology? Yeah, which... No. What is it? One more year. It does have a health bonus. You know what? Let's go crazy. What could possibly go wrong? Ah! Horrible mistreatment! Oh, I'm probably gonna die here, because I've got minus health, minus health, minus health. I'm 50 as well, that's a pretty low base health. Uh, we have a new son! Well, not ours, but again. New son of the dynasty. You are gonna be Nerf Rot. Nerf Rot. There you go. Welcome to the family, Nerf Rot. And yeah, we have our domain too big, that's because I have a huge penalty on my stats right now. I'll wait a little bit longer before I, I decide to do something with it, but I could give something holding away to my family. Can't stop thinking about all those prisoners. You know what? Oil up the rack. Let's be mean. We're gonna take out our frustration at things. Severely injured. We have died! And we are now playing as the first female character in our dynasty here. Um, pouch of gold. Donations from the richer family in your realm. Just that actually happened before I died. That was my previous character. Okay, so we are Duchess Eglantine of Orleans here. Our parents were well, Duke Big Franks, who I was just playing as, and our mother was the Duchess Sarazin. Um, our titles are Duchy of Orleans, Duchy of Savoy. Um, we've got a bunch of counties. We're a little low on that. Our husband is fifty-three and gay. Um, good diplomacy, though. We could use a little bit more stewardship, but I could always put this as a focus. Because I'm actually just on the cusp. Now, if I'm female, can I join these orders? Oh, I can. Oh, I can join the Hermetic Society. I'm going to join the Hermetic Society. We're going to do some potions and stuff. Yes. Oh, I like the red hood as well. That's very cool. Um, I'm betting it's going to want us to put, like probably going to want us to put learning as our goal, but I am going to temporarily go. Do I want... I might want business for a little bit more money. You know what? I've never gone rulership. Let's just do that. We'll get the plus three stewardship. We'll run this for now. Um, oh, I can tell... Make someone my apprentice. Exchange for tutoring. The apprentice will take care of one's laboratory and assist during experiments. That's cool. So yeah, I was going to say high learning is what we're going to want. Presumably someone who likes us okay too. Uh, let's use Martin, because I think, yeah, he's the heir of a few things. We'll use him. It's going to be cool. Um, ambition. Queen of France. Acquire title. Groom and heir. We... Heirs Anonymous. We don't actually have kids yet. I think we might have to get rid of our, of our husband. Our gay husband. Hmm... Let's go for grooming and air for now. We can get some extra kids going on, and that wouldn't be a terrible thing. So there we go. We're now at 9 of 9 for domain size. That's good. Um, we can set some crown focus. More likely to prosper. Well, I mean, we may as well just keep, you know, Orly as our, as our focus. We've got a lot of roles to a point. Wow. All right, we'll take you. J21 Bones, you're going to be fine. Possessed guy, sure, that's okay. What could possibly go wrong? Um, let's go for tax money over here. Uh, you can just statecraft, that's fine. Go for some military tech. And the cultural tech is probably okay. Council's discontent is... Well. 
Who's this? Oh. War for some counties. Okay, this is the King's War. I will join him in his war officially. I'm starting to think Cardinal Morris Maurice might fancy me. The one legged scarred You know what? We'll make some friends. Let's do it. We can get some bastard kids. It's gonna be fine. Went to Morris's chamber and gave him a good tussle. Tumble. Uh, accept assistance uh, for war. That's good. Um, I'll raise my own troops rather than using any of my vassal ones. And we'll get you to just chill out over here, I guess. Keep has been finished. Excellent. We've got a fair amount of money. We might want to save a little bit of money against, uh, in case we need mercs real quickly. Just because, you know, we're we're fairly new. A lot of things just got refreshed with our vassals. Although people like me a fair bit. We do have the Great Eminence here, which is very nice. Um, I don't know if that's helping us gain more points or anything. It's learning, and the fact that we're diligent is good. What can I do? I can write a theorem paper. Can gain esoteric knowledge. So I guess we will do that. So presumably, I don't know, mark it as an important decision. I will begin to write a theorem paper. I face the daunting task of researching and, re and writing an entire theorem paper reviewed by my peers. I have it to have it be accepted by the order of your beam to me, but the quality is found to be lacking. It might be a big blow. I can put in a decent effort. I have high diplomacy, so I can ask for some suggestions. Make an extraordinary effort. Spend a huge amount of money. Uh, lose some piety. Penalty to my stewardship. And maybe become stressed. I'll ask for help. Whatever. No shame in asking for help. Uh, I'm with child. Will my husband believe this? Uh, her countess is concerned about her non-inheriting son. She asks you to consider them when looking for new vassals. Use more good men. Oh, 200 gold to give away the county of St. Ange to this guy who... Uh, what does he feel about me? of me is a four, but it'll probably go up. <sighs> Saint Ange. Is that this one? Brings in tons of money? Or just grant it and get a favor. Can't get give out land to anyone who asks. Now I gotta keep it within the family. 200 gold be damned. Um, oh, we don't have a court physician. First, first of all, do we have someone with decent learning? We do, but let's go and do a little bit of a search here. Um, we want people who would join our court and who have the highest possible learning. 18. That's really as high as it goes? Wow. That could be better. Still, we might go on and go in and put in uh, a couple invites. Let's invite you to court. Excellent. Uh, a high intrigue person who likes me okay. We're going to invite you. And you. And some stewardship people. They don't like me that much and... Uh, we could use some good fighters. And just in case we need some diplomats. Well, women can't be made counselors. You're a genius. We are going to invite you to court. Maybe we can marry you off to someone. And you're strong. Let's invite you to court as well. Because I think then we get a lot more flexibility about, like, causing marriages to occur. That's something that I hadn't thought about before. Is just invite people to court with just good genetic traits. Even if they're not willing to marry right now. Yeah, you're 58, so it's a little old to be looking at something like that. Probably missing tons, but... Oh, I think there was... Bright and attractive. Invite to court. Invite to court. Okay, let's call that good enough for now. We are in a good position for linking up to this army as it comes by in a second here. Link. Because probably you're chasing these guys. So we will go ahead and do that. And that'll make me happy. There we go. Stomp, stomp, stomp. And some more stompage over there, apparently. There we go. I'll go ahead. Oh, the war just ended. So I can go and drop this. We're all in friendly territory. Excellent. Uh, special character actions. I could go into hiding. 
because someone is presumably trying to kill me. Oh, um, court physician. Yeah, we'll just go ahead and give it to you. So, known plots. We're not auto-stopping plots. You know what, let's, let's turn that on. Imprisoning people be damned. So this is me. Marcus, my kinsman, wants to kill me. Unwilling to say no. Or unwilling to change his mind. Uh, his opinion of me... Oh, there it is. The 22. You're not currently married. I don't know if I want you to marry anyone because you might get more stats going on here. It's a shame I can't do anything about you. It's finished! I've produced an excellent paper on Ascension. Uh, it explores the concept of Ascension and new ways by which the state might be achieved, which in turn might provide new approaches to Thurgy. Now it's left to do submit my, tip my Hermetic Pierce review. I send it out at once or it's not good enough to be published. Produced an excellent paper. I will send it out at once. Maybe opinion matters as well for this, but we'll see. Mm, things ended inconclusively. Considering your paper, decided to endorse it. Excellent. Endorse it, yes. Endorse it, yep. Excellent. Oh, you are not endorsing it! Jerk. How dare he, not good enough? Still, hopefully not everyone needs to endorse it for it to count. I can... Oh, I guess my court physician died. Uh, okay, fair enough. We will go here, and... Martin! You still have the 20, that's pretty good. And we also have an open council position with the chaplain, so I guess we'll put Martin on that as well. So you like me, and that's very handy. Just go ahead and... Oh, that's Hunt of Hostates, that's right. Um, which may or may not be a thing. This is some piety. It's actually a fairly high chance of finding apostates. You know what? We'll leave it on. And yeah, you just suck up sort of miscellaneously. That's going to be okay. The Duchess of Normandy wants to kill me. <sighs> Alright, what we can what can we do at this point? First of all, is there any chance... Man. Um, oops. Man, that dynasty is uh, getting a little harder to keep going here. I wonder if we'd want to do some inbreeding. <laughs> uh, I wonder if you'd be willing... Oh, you must already be married. Yeah. As I say, be married to do some uh, match linear stuff so that we can secure a backup route to inheriting France. So, we've got a while to go before we can change the laws. We have to live... Oh. Right, right, we gotta run this. But I can change these laws now, and then it'll put some sort of cooldown, right? Like, it's it's not just once per whatever. Ten years, peace, regency, viceroy, negative opinion, which isn't there, da 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 has not been forced to change laws. Yeah, so we can become more centralized, giving us a bigger domain size, even though it's stewardship. There's traitors and lawful subjects. If I do this... Like, is this just better than just allowed? Because it lets me grab titles more easily? Maybe. And I'd want to stay more Catholic. I don't know if religious implies allowed. Maybe it is. But in any case, I think we're going to go ahead and pass higher centralization. So we can have fewer vassals, but I think that's going to be okay. Yeah, and I can have more land directly. We're going to go ahead and do this. We're going to put a cut in here as well. And um, we'll follow, continue this next time. Thanks for watching. See you then.